The CHR6DM orientation sensor uses the Earth's magnetic field to compute yaw angle, where zero yaw corresponds to when the x-axis is aligned of the device is aligned with magnetic north. The problem is that depending on where you are in the Earth, the magnetic field is a little bit different. So when you first receive the CHR, CHR6DM, it needs to be calibrated for your location. To do that, um, there's some software, configuration software that will help and I'll demonstrate how to use it. Uh, as you can see, I'm already connected to the device and we're getting data. So I'll go ahead and open the configuration dialog and go to the EKF tab. The mag ref factor is what we'll be setting here. Uh, the reference factor corresponds to the expected magnetometer output when the yaw angle is zero. So what we'll do is we'll align the magnetic sensor with magnetic north and then we'll click the set yaw reference button and that is the, uh, the reference vector that the sensor will use for uh, yaw angle estimation. We can tell when we're aligned with magnetic north by looking at the bottom right hand plot for the magnetic sensors. The red line is the y-axis magnetic sensor and when the x-axis is perfectly aligned, the y-axis should be giving zero. So I'll go ahead and rotate until the y-axis goes to zero and the x-axis is positive. And then I'll go ahead and click the set yaw reference button. And uh, okay, so we've set the yaw reference and uh, that should pull the uh, estimated yaw angle close to zero. And uh, you can see that it did. Those, uh, those changes are committed to RAM. If we want those changes to last after we cycle the power on the device, then we need to go down and hit flash commit. And as you can see here, the write to flash command was sent and uh, was successful. So that's how to set the reference vector on the CHR6DM uh, for yaw angle correction.